All right. Hey friends, this is Colleen with Stir the Soul and I am uh, going to do a Bible review on the New Living Translation, the Filament Bible. Um, and this is the Wide Margin Journaling Edition. So I'm super excited to receive this and can't wait to show you all. So I'm going to unbox it and you can see it has a leather like cover. Um, it does have one ribbon in there and the gold foil on the edges is super pretty. Um, and it's a wide margin, so it has the lines for journaling. Uh, let's go ahead and just kind of um, flip through here a little bit. Uh, I've not, I just received the Bible a few days ago, so I've not really looked at it. The pages are um, white and they're... A uh, very clean, a clean white color. Uh, let's go back here and I'm going to check and see if it's a red letter Bible. It is because I just saw it. Yep, there we go. So it is a red letter Bible, New Living Translation. Um, and this is their filament Bible, which is um, a super fun study Bible. So I'm going to show you how the filament works because I've not set this Bible up yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to this page right here and it has the um, QR code for the filament and I'm going to pull my iPad out. Um, okay, so this you download the filament app and once you have it, um, you're going to hit I'm ready to go. Um, give it a second right here. So this is what this is going to do is it's going to be a study Bible um, without the study notes in your Bible. So if you have your phone with you, an iPad or other device, you would then be able to look up more um, like scripture or video. Um, and I actually have their um, portable. Okay, so I need to add, I think I hit the wrong thing. Um, so I have it hooked up to the NLT Thinline Bible. So we're going to switch it. We're going to activate a new Bible. Okay, so I've got a Bible and I can't wait to get started. So we're going to hit connect now. Um, it's asking for us to see that, which is this right here. So we're going to say got it. And then I need to open. Hold on, let me just take, I have the case on. So it's blocking my camera view. So we're going to do this and put that over there. So that is how quick it is to do it. And then, so it says to turn to page 1383 in your Bible. Um, so let me flip Sorry, there. I don't know that. Alexa, stop listening. Um, sorry about that. And so 1383. Okay. So it's on 1383. I'm going to come back here. I'm going to hit the camera button and then I'm going to line these little diamond shapes up with the top of the page right there. And then we're going to hit go. Okay. And so then that took us to Luke one through two, which is where we are. So if you're on here, you could click study. And this is going to bring up the study notes that are on chapter one and two. Um, you have study notes. You have a book overview. So if you want to learn more about Luke, who it was written to, the purpose and all that. You have the people. Um, so these are the people that are going to be discussed during chapters one and two of Luke, which is Abraham, Rome, uh, Roman empires, Mary, uh, mother of Jesus, David, and John the Baptist, and then themes. These are the themes that you could look for. So that's just under the study notes. If we go back here and you hit reflect, these are going to be devotionals that other people have done that are included. So, and they tell you which verses um, they cover. So there's the Lord's servant, um, Luke 1, 26 through 56. Somebody else did those same verses, but they're going to talk about Mary's sacrifice. Um, so here is just more that you can read and understand. And then the third thing is the C. So if you wanted to see a video on the gospel of Luke, you could study more. Um, they show word studies, the covenants, and so you could watch these and learn. I think that's the last one. So, I mean, we have just for two chapters, we have about 10 videos, um, roughly here. And so you could learn. So how does this help you is that, um, the filament is really 
cool because you're not carrying around. Typically, my study Bible is much bigger than my other Bibles, and it has lots of notes. Um, and I don't always have my study Bible with me, but I do have the pocket size. I don't have it downstairs with me. It's the pocket size NLT with the flowers on it, and it zips around the side of it. Love it. That's always in my purse. Um, and with that one, if I'm out and about and I'm reading or somebody is asking a question about certain verses, I can pull it up on my phone because my phone is always with me and have the study notes with me to dig a little deeper or to gain a better understanding and then share that. Um, so it's a great advantage. And so uh, they have the thin line, um, uh, the thin line translations, which are smaller, um, super thin and smaller than this. And now this is the new one that has the wide margins so that we can journal in it um, and write notes. And I think this would be great for just as you're really studying the notes that you gather from the app um, to be able to put them in here. Um, lots of writing can happen. Uh, highlighting, coloring the pages are super thick. Um, I mean, they're not like crazy thick, but they're not super thin Bible pages. So they're going to be great to use different types of pen with not a lot of bleed through. Um, and I just overall, I think it's a really pretty Bible. I like the, um, uh, the pattern on here and it does have like some shine to it. Um, then it catches the light. It's super pretty embossed, um, leaves and all that. So yeah, this is, um, the filament NLT wide margin um, version. Words are in red. It lays flat, full color of the Bible, and then works with this filament study Bible app, which is amazing. And like I said, um, use it often. And so, um, and because I did not show this earlier, but all the pages have the little diamond on there. So any page you flip to that you want to study more, you just pull out your phone or iPad, take a picture of that. It pulls up that page and you can go directly to the pages you want to go to. So um, I think this is a great Bible. Super excited that they came out with the journaling version of this Bible. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.